Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and this is a little tips and tricks video. If you would like to have a more classic look to your Windows start menu, for example something that would look more like this, this is more of a uh, Windows 7 style menu if you want for the start menu, if you would rather tweak and play around with all of this well you have an option uh, that is different from what we had in the past so one of the apps to customize the menu that was very popular was classic shell but classic shell had been abandoned and um, was more and more buggy over time because it didn't have any updates well somebody decided to uh, do something else so classic shell has changed its name to OpenShell. And what is OpenShell? Well, OpenShell is the new way of that menu, of that uh, software, the new name, OpenShell Menu, which is Classic Shell Reborn, as you see here. It is available on GitHub, and of course, you install it and choose the style of menu you want. And of course, it has different styles, different things you can do. So um, you decide what you want. And if you want, you can actually, uh, you know, um, change whatever options um, that you want. So uh, you can go into the open shell menu settings and change things as you wish. Uh, the open shell will actually give you access to different options. Um, that you'll have available to customize your start menu. So open shell, and here we go. So this is the menu that in some of the choices, you can select skins, you can select what uh, different options, you can even uh, use your own pictures and uh, you know change the, the, the style of uh, whatever you want of the menu. So for example, Windows 7 style, you would you know, just do this and then you'd select whatever button you want. Let's say I want to have arrow button here and I click OK. It modifies immediately your start menu. So this is really the feel of Windows 7 that you have here, including the shutdown button and stuff. Gives you access, of course, to everything, including your settings app and uh, all, all is in there. Uh, a restart might be required and some. it doesn't change anything. If you don't like it, if you don't want this, you can just uninstall it. It'll get back to what you actually had before as a, a start menu. So what you do is you go to this page that I'll actually have available as a, a link. Once you go here, it's going to say view on GitHub. So what you got to do, download. And here it says download if you want to use it. Downloads. You go here and you'll see the... Uh, version number 4.4.160 right now and it is you just go down it is open shell setup 44160 is here you just click that download that install and once you install you choose your feel of windows that you want to have and it's going to work great and if you don't like it you can of course revert back and simply uninstall the software to have your start menu go back to normal so I will share this page with uh, everybody that uh, wants to uh, try it out. Maybe you'd like to go back into what was, was more like a Windows 7 style uh, program or setting or uh, you know look and feel basically if you want. It doesn't necessarily um, work all the time exactly as it should but as there will be new versions available there is going to be of course some changes so uh, if some of the stuff doesn't work exactly as it should uh, you still have the options you know to go to the action center and start the settings app and do the whatever this is all still functional no problem so open shell which is and was classic classic shell and as you see here classic shell reborn if you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.